Hello ladies and gentlemen and thank you for tuning in for another one of my fantasticular videos. And today I am going to be reviewing this beauty right here. The Sony XB60 wireless Bluetooth speaker. I'm Mike Heath, also known here and on social media as Mr. 904 Direct. I'm a 34 year old video professional that is happily married and loves traveling. For years, I've been on Jacksonville Jaguars game days as part of the video crew, have run an award-winning wedding videography company, and I'm also an award-winning film director, producer, and actor living in Jacksonville, Florida. Now, I've decided to use these skills to share my experiences learning new skills and working on many different projects. This is my channel, and it's going to have a little bit of everything. So make sure you subscribe and keep tuning in for this adventure. Uh, there's a lot of really great features on this uh, speaker. Uh, first of all, it takes a charge, holds a charge, and lasts for hours. I mean, honestly, I just turn it on and off whenever I want. I've literally had these things for months and charged them like once. I have two of them now. Um, and uh, I was able to get these things refurbished for uh, around like 125 bucks each. I mean... That's nothing for the quality, the sound, uh, how loud these things are. These things, for being as little as they are, they're just absolutely freaking amazing. Um, uh, one of the great things is, too, um, it has, like, a, a pair feature. Um, you can pair up to 10 of these things together for a party feature. Like, if you want to play some all throughout a, a venue or something, like if you're a DJ or uh, you're just having a house party or whatever the case is, you can put one in your living room, one in you know, different other rooms or out in the backyard or on the front lawn or whatever the case is, um, you, you'll be able to, you know, pair up to 10 of these things and run, them, run the first one off of Bluetooth and it's just a, a relay through Bluetooth uh, and it's called the party chain. Um, and it's really easy to pair these things too. Uh, I use it with my iPad um, and uh, I've connected Bluetooth um, and um, actually um, I use uh, Spotify a lot on it. Um, now, um, with this thing, um, it has all kinds of um, connections. It's an AC uh, adapter in uh, for power. Um, it takes a USB flash drive. Uh, it also has um, your audio ins and outs for your left and right channels. Uh, it has a, mock, or a mic uh, input. Um, and uh, then also you have a mic level that you can control on the back of these things. Um, but it ha also has an extra bass button um, and as well. Um, you can, you know, plug in your USB device and control everything through that and still run through the party chain ef uh, effect with all your different speakers. Um, really cool, um, too, is you can use these actually for phone calls, believe it or not. Uh, it actually can accept and uh, you can, you know, make outbound calls while connected to it on Bluetooth. Um, it's really, really nice because it has these really easy grip handles on the side to carry it with on both sides. And then also... Um, one, one really cool thing, um, is that, um, you get an app with it. Um, and I'm doing a little screen capture here, so we're going to go ahead and transition on over to that real quick. And, um, you'll be able to see that I already have my Spotify up. Of course, that's what I'm using. Um, now with that said, uh, I'm going to go ahead and go on over to my, uh, Fiestable app. It's called the Fiestable app, and you can see it right there. We're gonna go ahead and pop that bad boy open. Just some really cool things, like, um, you know, I mean, it's uh, honestly, it's just fun to play with. But um, you know, I mean, if you get good at using them, maybe you could find an, a, a way to, you know, DJ or you know, house party with them. Um, anyway, you can do like some motion control. You can do some illumination. Today, I'm really only gonna just talk about. The effect for speaker purposes um, and uh, that includes your DJ kind of controls through the Fiesta app now in that Fiesta app um, there is uh, a flanger effect um, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn on some music and I'm gonna kind of go over these and you will see them um, but um, you will see it but I'm going to just kind of show you um, basically all you have to do is just tap on whatever option you want and then just, you know, swipe your finger across the, in the center pad there, or, uh, you can, um, go into, um, uh, you can go over to, you know, like your isolator, your flanger, um, you have drum scratch. You also have down here at the bottom, 
your reggae horn, <laughs> reggae horn, um, and, um, and, and other little things there. You have your scratch. Um, you have all those cool little effects and stuff. So um, I'm going to kind of just turn on the play some music and show you uh, by playing it through kind of what it looks like when you're just kind of touching through it. Okay, so let's do this. So let me pull up my Spotify. And here we go. Right, back to Fiesta Bull. And then you just, when you get the Fiesta Bull app up, you just got to go through and hit DJ control there. Okay, now let's play with the flanger. Yeah, you see, kind of just phases and flanges that a little bit there. Go to the isolator. And it kind of keeps that bass. And, you know, it just kind of numbs everything out. So now you got the wall. And some of these give a little bit of a different effect if you kind of like swipe around with it. Uh, now, if you go over to drums, you just kind of do like that. All right. And then uh, you just go to scratch like that. You got the reggae horn like that. All right. And then you just kind of play with those different things there. But anyway, um, that's the Fiesta Bowl app. And we're going to go ahead and turn this music bag off here. Bam. And that is the Fiesta Bowl app, using it with Bluetooth connectivity. You know, obviously, if you, you know, a lot of you out there know, already know how to connect your apps to, um, you know, through Bluetooth so and devices. So um, that part shouldn't be too difficult for you. Um, but um, uh, maybe I'll do another video at some point on Bluetooth connectivity and if... if it seems to be an issue for anybody. Um, but for right now, that is the Sony XB60 uh, wireless Bluetooth speaker. And uh, hope this video has been informative. Stay tuned. Oh, yeah. And um, as always, <laughs> go ahead and comment, like, and subscribe.